So it actually might be quite fascinating that I caught up with the Marvel Cinematic Universe very recently. So it wasn't until after the quarantine that I understood the hype of these movies and of the characters. And throughout this I found one character to always stand out. The one and only Loki of Asgard. He was always burdened with glorious purpose and yet there are other things that I like about this character and I know that many of you would agree with me. So here are some reasons that I like Loki and why you should too. Without further ado, let's get started. Number 1. Tom Hiddleston He played the role of Loki in the movies and I think he is a great actor. He's able to convey all these complex emotions of Loki and he is a cutie too. That might be why the big screen Loki was so popular with the MCU fans and with me as well. Number 2. He isn't evil. Well, not exactly. He might have done some terrible things but that was only because his parents hid the truth from him to protect him. I mean, how many times have you heard that excuse? He has gone through a lot of trauma and finding out that he was different definitely hit him hard. He isn't evil, just hurt. I know that doesn't give him a right to do anything bad, but I think we should consider it before we judge him so cruelly. He isn't exactly manly. So unlike his brother Thor, he doesn't rely on strength entirely. He is witty and clever and I think those qualities are derived from the original Loki from Norse mythology, where he was always using his wits to get out of the most difficult situations. Number 4. He is a very humorous character. So he's very funny in the MCU, his jokes seem to crack the MCU fans right up, especially if you understand some of the references, and his lines are also incredible. He has been given the sarcastic slash humorous lines and I think that's just a great combination for his character. Number 5. Loki is a very complex character. So it takes a while for us to understand his true motivations and intentions, but I think that makes him more human. He may be smart and powerful like a god, but not entirely without faults and vulnerabilities. He is selfish, lazy, cruel, and he is sensitive and vulnerable, especially in the Loki series, where you can see that he tries his best to protect Sylvie, even if it means putting himself in danger. This makes him very relatable. You know the whole being lazy and vulnerable, not the whole putting yourself in danger for Sylvie part, you know? Number 6. I love his character arc. So if you're a fan of roller coasters, you would too. He started off bad, became kinda good, turned out that he was only good to trick Thor, thus he was bad, and became good again. But unfortunately he died. And the Loki series as well, he was bad and evil and selfish when the series began, but by the sixth and last episode, his only concern was protecting the multiverse and protecting Sylvie from making the wrong decision. And he tried hard but ultimately failed. Wow, it's just his story ends in failure always. It's sad. Number 7. Now just like a roller coaster, his emotions and thoughts change quite often. You never know what he's going to do next or what thoughts are exactly going through his head. This makes people sit on the edge of their seats, always waiting to see Loki's next move. Number 8. Here's a fun and kind of crazy one. He has a great sense of fashion. One of his outfits that I loved very much is from Thor Ragnarok, where he and Thor had come to Earth to get their father back. I mean that black suit just wants you to say, damn. Number 9. His powers. He has a large set of them and he always uses them in the ways that fit him the best. Illusion specifically is one of my favorites. And that unfortunately brings me to the end of this week's video. I think Loki definitely needs to come back to the main MCU timeline, but all we can do is keep our fingers crossed. I'm definitely excited to see him in season 2 of Loki series. Anyways, comment down below and tell me the reasons that you love Loki. I hope you guys enjoyed, please subscribe to my channel, like this video and share with your friends. Thank you and I'll see you guys in another video, goodbye!